So today I'm going to take a look at alkanoic acids. They used to be called carboxylic acids because the functional group is the carboxyl group, C double O H. Um, let's first of all take a look at the general formula. And this we show like this, R C double O H. The R, of course, we've seen before, which is C N H 2 N plus 1. And this is a so called monovalent, it's got one valency, monovalent functional group. And don't forget, it's the functional group that gives these organic chemicals their properties. And this monovalent functional group is called carboxyl. This, they form a homologous series. We've, we've uh, met the homologous series before with alkenes and alkanes. And we're just going to take a quick look at the first four acids in this homologous series. The first one has the formula H C double O H. So there's actually only one carbon atom, and this is methanoic. acid and this is found in ants and it used to be called oh, so the old name if you want was formic acid and this is the thing that sort of stings if a if an ant bites you the next in the group has two carbon atoms, so we've got CH3, C double O H, and this one I'm sure you know, maybe not under its name, ethanoic acid, and this is basically vinegar and the old name was acetic acid the next one in the group of course has three carbon atoms so C 2 H 5 C double O H And this is propanoic acid. This is found in, for example, in dairy products. And is, for example, responsible for the smell of a strong Swiss cheese. The old name is propionic acid. So finally, we have in the beginning of this homologous group, an acid with four carbon atoms, so C three H seven C double O H and this is butanoic acid.
And this you find in, for example, in rancid butter. Or even more noteworthy, <laughs> in sweaty socks. So you can always blame butanoic acid for your sweaty socks. The old name came from the Greek for butter, which was butyric acid. So those are the four examples from this homologous group, alkanoic acids, going from methanoic through to butanoic acid. Thank you.